Tencent is one of China's most powerful technology firms. The company, which was founded in 1998, is headquartered in Shenzhen and has offices in Tokyo and Seoul, as well as Amsterdam and Palo Alto, California. The company's mission is to promote sustainability and innovation, while also assisting in the shaping of the economy's digital future. Alibaba Group and Baidu are two companies you've probably heard a lot about. These are two of China's most recognizable technology firms. Alibaba is known for its retail and e-commerce focus, whereas Baidu is known for its artificial intelligence and specialty services like mapping and data storage. Tencent Holdings, on the other hand, is a tech company that isn't always on investors' radars. The corporate structure of Tencent is divided into six distinct groups. Instant messaging, online media, wireless internet value-added services, interactive media services, social apps, online advertising, and cloud services are among the company's products and services. Number 1. Cloud and Smart. This department is responsible for the internet and cloud services provided by the company. Tencent can use this segment to establish a presence in the digital assistant space in a variety of industries, including finance, retail, and healthcare. Number 2. Content and Platform. Tencent's proprietary internet platform is overseen by PCG, which integrates it with the company's social, content, and traffic platforms. Tencent's social media, app store, news, live streaming, and movies are all included. Number 3. Entertainment Group. Tencent's interactive entertainment offerings, such as video games and online sports, are overseen by the IEG. Tencent Sports, one of China's largest sports media platforms, is one of the offerings in this segment. It is the only broadcaster of national and international sporting events, including the French Open, Formula One, NBA, MLB, NHL, and NFL games. Number 4. Group of Technology Engineers. This division supports the company's operational platforms and is Asia's largest networking, device, and data center provider. This division is critical to the company's RAND initiatives, which include the AI and Frontier Technology divisions. Tencent wants to help by collaborating on open source projects and developing new computing platforms. It also assists with corporate and business innovation. Number 5. Weixin Group. This division is in charge of the company's Weixin business ecosystem. Fintech platforms are included in this. Platforms like Weixin Pay and Weixin slash WeChat are part of this group. Weixin Pay, also known as WeChat Pay outside of China, is a mobile payment solution that is available in over 60 countries and 17 currencies. Tencent's Weixin slash WeChat was released in 2011 and is one of the world's fastest growing social apps, combining messaging, communication, and gaming into a single app. As of March 2020, Weixin and WeChat had a combined MAU of 1.2 billion. Number 6. Group for Corporate Development The Corporate Development Group is responsible for the research and development of new businesses in areas such as financial technology, advertising, and marketing. Business Tenpay, China's most popular online payment platform, offers an integrated payment service for B2B e-commerce platforms. Recent Developments at Tencent During the fiscal year 2020, the company announced a number of product enhancements and innovations. Tencent's video accounts platform, for example, allows social media users and businesses to share videos publicly. Businesses can reach a larger audience and increase customer transactions. Younger users' social experiences were also improved by AI-powered gaming and video viewing capabilities through video calls. Tencent also announced a number of gaming-related developments, including the launch of the Call of Duty game in China and the distribution of more than 1 million Nintendo Switch consoles to users by the end of the year, thanks to its partnership with Nintendo. During the year, the company continued to innovate in its cloud and other business services, leading to the development of a new generation of its Star Lake SA3 server. This allows the company to improve its AI, security, network, and storage capabilities. In addition, the company announced an one Hong Kong dollar and 60 cents annual dividend payment to shareholders. This is an increase from the previous calendar year when shareholders were paid one Hong Kong dollar and 20 cents per share. 
Tencent's development has been aided by China's consumer spending and rapidly expanding internet access and usage. The country's leaders have placed a special emphasis on the country's technology and internet sectors, which has resulted in a slew of large-scale investments in space-related businesses. Overall, China's governmental and economic attention to the industry, along with Tencent's dedication to improving its inventive skills, should benefit both customers and investors.